Welcome back to yet another YouTube video, guys. I decided that last time I tried shooting this video, but then a lot of things went wrong. But then hopefully today nothing's gonna get deleted. But yeah, I'm gonna be shooting a move in vlog. Basically, I am moving in to my res again, same room as last year. Not much will be changing actually, but I intend to change a lot of things because I'm trying to go minimalist with the things I have in my room. I felt that like last year there was a lot of things that I need to get rid of. Um, so yeah, if you know any thrift stores anywhere, just leave them in the description. And don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe because the rest of the video I'll just be doing a voiceover. So yeah, bye! <laughs> So as you can see like the minute that you enter the room like there were just boxes everywhere because I had to go fetch the boxes from different areas but these were from the storage um, unit so you're gonna see like different sets of boxes that I'm gonna come in with then I was just emptying out everything because it's the first thing that you need to do empty out stuff and see what needs to go where I had so many books that I had to give away and sell which is exactly what I did then I packed my wardrobe as you can see, it, looks, it already looks, yeah, neat. Then now, it's just, you know, piling up my stuff and realizing I have a lot of binders for no reason. So I sold most of them. <laughs> but then as you can see, like, I was really proud of how my wardrobe looked. Okay, um, so it's another day. As you can see, I am a mess because your girl has been... Hey, hey, number one, trash, fingers. You see, this is like life is just a struggle right now for me. And I just had to, yeah, I had to go to Mama's Bay to go fetch my stuff. Heck, a couple of difficulties getting transport, got lost. It's just a whole story for another day. And yeah, man, but then the, the day ended quite well. Managed to get all of my stuff, and I'm back in my room, and I'm gonna continue packing and unpacking. And yeah. Hope you guys are enjoying the video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my youtube channel because there is no way you are watching this video without going through the way so like the video subscribe to the channel join the family and comment down in the comment section if you're enjoying yourself and yeah continue watching so the mess continued for like the next day after i went to fetch the rest of my stuff as you can see like that big ball is my a bean bag, my printer, like all the other stuff that I fetched from Mama's Baby. And yo, oh, the trip there was just a lot. But as you can see, I had a lot of other clothes that needed to be packed. There's so much that was going on, so I emptied the whole thing. Then, as you can see, my friend came to help me pack. And then we were going through some of my uh, memory box. And then I threw away a lot of things because I just was like, mm, do I really need to keep all these things? But yeah, just finished up picking up so that I can go to sleep with the same mind. <laughs> Hi again. Oh my god, my voice is trashy because I literally just woke up. I know, I look beautiful when I wake up, I do. But then like I just woke up and I was like, you know what, let's just fix everything because my mind is just speaking about how things are not clean. So this is day number three of move in and yeah you guys saw where i last ended yesterday only have two boxes to go through and a couple of things to give away so yeah i'm just gonna get into that and yeah man but yes and yesterday someone else was helping me out um she's probably gonna come back today again so if you see her on the channel on the videos that are fast forward and stuff um yeah man she was helping <laughs> I woke up so early that day that the first thing I thought about was fix your room because yeah it looked like neat last night but obviously I was not done I just packed things up and piled them then I was going through some of my files my, my, my binders my documents and putting things in boxes things I needed to sell things I just thought I didn't need and yeah see those plastics and things like, like these binders yeah I sold all of them um yeah man I just wanted to clear out my room and that was um this i was unpacking my toiletries and wash stuff and all those things that i need hi so i look kind of gangster because i'm tired but yeah 
So I have been trying to clean my room and you know set it up for um I think about uh started last week so I'm still at it and it's just a quick update. It's Wednesday today, the twenty fourth of uh what? March, yes. Yeah, I'm just tired, don't mind me. But yeah, I hope you guys are still enjoying it keeping it short because i yeah i don't want this to be super long but yeah hope you guys are enjoying it don't forget to like comment share and subscribe because there is no way you can watch this video and not like it okay 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 why am i getting so close to the camera so disrespectful i kind of wish i would have filmed this in a better angle but all i was doing here was just like measuring using a ruler and a pencil just to have them sized up properly because like I'm hella broke, I decided why not make your own shop, Marilyn? So I'm gonna explain what's currently happening right now. So um, I put like the wrong base on the on the wrong side, but that's why it's like this at the moment. But I'm gonna fix this soon. Um, so what's happening is that I have Whoop. okay. So. Instead of finding super glue, I decided to make these mini, like, not mini, basically I have like, see every line there is going to be a space and then I'm going to enter boxes through and as you can see the boxes are not fully um, on so I'm going to buy like some baskets that are going to go in here and then I'll buy spray paint, make this look cute. <laughs> then yeah hopefully it turns out the way i want it to turn out but as you can see i'm putting three different types of boxes all together to make it very strong you know so that it doesn't you know it doesn't fall as you can see when i do this it doesn't move to the bottom because i don't think i'm going to put anything heavy but yeah just then you guys know that i know how to diy i just don't know how to shoot myself doing diy but yes i have a killer knife in my room <laughs> and yep that's where it's, I don't know, by the way, I put my mirror there, so and another one there, and then I have another one there. I'm gonna buy another mirror, put it there, um, because I love mirrors. <laughs> After a long turn of event, as you can see the floor, I've even changed my shirt, because your girl was manhandling them boxes, and I'm kind of happy with the way it turned out, because I, this is what I had in mind. You don't know what happened at the end there, it's just, I think it's the only one that's not straight. Yeah, something happened, probably. No one cares, but I'm like, anyway, look at my cute little shelf. I'm gonna spray paint it, so when I sh shoot the final room tour, you guys are most probably going to see it, you know, go away. I don't know if I can give a detailed tutorial about how I did this thing, but like, if people want to know, I can make it another make it again for someone else but yeah this is the finished product your girl just saved 400 rand cash see wisdom wisdom <laughs> so after a very long time i i'm finally done with my room i think i'm comfortable with the way it looks for now and then obviously during the year i might add some things separate some things lose some things as well and so on but i just want to give you guys the final tour around it because there were some parts that i couldn't film but then i wish i should have but i just couldn't because i was too busy or preoccupied because i really was packing on some days cleaning on other days so yeah because i use cleaning as a coping mechanism of stress so yeah i'm just gonna give you guys a quick tour around my room and yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed my move in to May's vlog, even though it took two weeks to film. <laughs> so yeah. So when you enter my room, you get very simple. I know the light is probably flashing on camera. You get a very simple basic setup. So I'm just going to show you like when you enter what you see. So right there, I have my full body mirror and down underneath that I have my laundry basket and then I have my dustpan and my 
broom it's very small but then it works i'm not that tall and then here i am babysitting my friend's plant because she has to uh, go to another province and then just up here i don't know why they place this thing here but uh yeah this is where i put my other stuff as you can see man i, I don't think i need to explain what those are and then you just have the door here then at the bottom i have my tissues just sliding up because it's easier to just go out no need to switch there then i have this cute little mirror going on there because your girl loves mirrors and i have the yeah i showed you guys this mirror um then i have my bedding which is very um like i like the i, I don't know i just love this um constructor colors or the colors that are on the bed right now like the bedding color and everything it just goes it blends so well with the rest of my room because as you can see here i have a beige carpet um and then i have a like a bean bag you guys must have seen this one in the previous room tour uh just a beige bag just a yeah bean bag with a beige cushion and then um a lot of things have changed on my study table so then when you get here at the bottom there you just get that stuff um those are things i just don't know where to put <laughs> so i put them underneath day then i have like a plug here so these plugs just all in hopefully like the light is just being disturbed so much because of this weather outside and then here i have so this is my desk so these lights turn on like i have all these motivational scriptures on there like god has a plan for you seek first the kingdom of god that's in ephesians 6 7. no verse 53 yes if i remember properly but i just have sticky notes as well sticking on there just makes it easy like these sticky notes have like like color code you know like just a lot going on so i would do a detailed like desk tour if you guys are interested so i can explain everything else and it's just yeah then the difference now is up here because last time there was obviously a lot of binders but now I was like you know what I, need, I i want the space to be as clean and clear as possible so i decided to move to a simple binder system where i just use one binder for semester for everything else because some of my binders were just okay right we're just yeah you see i just have very basic things going on there just have this big binder for second semester and then i just have these two uh these folders are your compact folders so they're, they when you, when, you, when you open them up they, they take up a lot of space and then i have some like a dictionary spelling dictionary because i'm quite horrible with words or spelling so i'm still getting better and i just have books there like anyone can rise and then i have Grey's anatomy which is like these are flashcards um, and then I have my devotional, my Bible, my uh, prayer book, my this is my notebook for church, and then that's the OT tech book, and then that's the physics uh, manual, and then yeah, and then for this semester it's pretty basic and I'm sure you guys are shocked like but what is that image at the background? Here? So we did that for an OT assignment just recently and then I was like, you know what, I think I have a perfect space we can keep this. And yeah, me and my partner agree that my room is gonna be so perfect. And then I have a binder for the semester. And then I have two notebooks. Then this is my prayer journal. Yeah, it's purple so just thought you see like this side is purple the other side is blue and white so as you can see here i have our father's house it's a, uh, a book about serving and then i have rich dad poor dad it's a book about money obviously and then i have my small poetry journal and then i have my um calculator there and then um that's pretty much most of the stuff here i didn't do much of organizing because i haven't done grocery shopping but like it's just basic stuff and yeah and then i made i'm sure you guys saw in the video that i made um i made a 
shelf and this is the end product of the shelf or how it automatically looks so this is how it looks right now because it's a bit messy but then this is it's close to what i wanted but i'm gonna buy another one to put there but yeah pretty basic there's really not much going on in my wardrobe very messy but yeah that's all